Hello friends, this is Avinash Pujari. Today I am going to show you AIX 7.2 installation on Power7 server. So this is our HMC and Power7 server is already registered with it. Select the server, go to the options, click on configuration, create logical partition and select AIX or Linux. Then here you can see that partition ID is 3 because uh, already uh, two partitions are there and I'll give the partition name AIX 7.2 click on next and I want to give the profile name Pro1 so I need this one for the installation purpose so I'll use this Pro1 and click on next this power 7 server is virtualized so uh, two options are available dedicated and shared so I'll go with the shared option and for the installation of AIX 7.2 minimum 0.1 processor is sufficient but in this case I'll go with the 2.0 then desired processing unit 2.5 and maximum processing unit 3.0 and uh, here minimum processing units required for each virtual processor is 0.10 so minimum virtual processors I'll give here 20 desired virtual processors 25 and maximum virtual processor 30 next for the installation 2 GB RAM is sufficient here I'll give 4 GB minimum desired memory 6 GB and uh, 256 MB maximum memory 8 GB and 512 MB click on next all these I devices I want to give to the AI 7.2 I don't want to create any virtual adapters so I'll click on next and boot the system into the SMS mode. Select SMS, click next. So this is the complete profile summary. Partition ID is 3 AX. Partition name is 7.2. Installing AX 7 or a Linux. Profile name Pro 1. 6 GB RAM. Processing unit 2.5. Finish. So you can see that AX 7.2 partition has been created successfully now let's do the installation for that select the machine go to the operation activate profile select pro 1 open terminal window or a console session we need to select this and go to the advanced option and here boot mode boot mode SMS select SMS and click on OK it will start the installation here in SMS menu we need to make first boot device as a CD-ROM so if you want to do the installation through the name then um, go with the second option that is set up remote IPL but we don't want name right now so select the fifth option then press 1 select install boot device order here we can click on list all devices press 7 enter and select first boot device as a CD-ROM are you sure you want to exit system management services one yes and it will start our installation of AIX 7.2 type 1 and press enter to use this terminal and type 1 and press enter to have English during install start install now with default setting if you want to change the setting select the second option enter 
and you can see that system has selected migration and the uh, disk where you want to install so why it has selected migration because already ax7.1 operating system is there okay so uh, system has selected method of installation migration so we want to change that so select the first option here new and complete overwrite we don't want to do the migration press one enter and disk where you want to install the operating system so select the disk drive select edition there are two uh, editions available with 7.2 standard and enterprise we'll select the standard edition and do the installation zero install with the current settings listed above so press zero enter so these are the choices this is the summary press one and continue with install Once the installation is done, configuration assistant will be opened and there we need to set the date and time, root password and uh, IP address of the system, host name of the system and we have to accept the licenses also. So you can see that AIX 7.2 operating system is running successfully. This way we do the installation. Thank you for watching this video, don't forget to subscribe our channel.